Hello fellow gunners, Tim here at the Reloading Bench. Uh, Fuzzy said if I got one of these uh, knit hats that it would make my videos better. Alright. <laughs> he also said that if I got a lead loader, it would make my loads better. I don't know about that. I was digging in the closet the other day and dug this out. Now my finesse was showing <clears throat> paperwork ain't near as good as fuzzies. Here's the instructional book, or instruction book. And they've got, now the, I really don't even know how old this is. Let's see if we can find a copyright on this. All right, here's a copyright right here. 1963. <clears throat> so at least we know this came out after 63. <laughs> but this is for a uh, 410 gauge 3 inch shell. And here's what the dipper that is provided in it throws. With uh, Hercules 2400. And here's the dipper. It's not even plastic, guys. It's metal. And I've got a dipper. <laughs> you can tell this. This has really been used a lot. <laughs> It's been in my closet for probably 20 years. <laughs> no, maybe 15. But the, it's, it's metal. It is a cool little kit. Got your the priming tool oh, I don't see the thing oh there you shut your uh, hole on there to uh, knock the uh, primer out with a decapping rod. You'd have your shell in here and knock it right out. <clears throat> and then, I guess I should look at the instructions. Somebody's gonna have to give me instructions, help the instructions. All right, here we go. It's showing that you uh, set your primer on top of this, and then your hole. Oh, my fingers don't work like they used to. Well, anyway, then you take the little push rod and push it down, and it knocks the primers in. Then you uh, charge it and Put a wad in your shot. <clears throat> then you put your hole in through the bottom here. And then start down on it and it starts to cramp. Then you take this little 
rod thing here and just with manual pressure push it down and finish your crimp and then your shells loaded I thought that's pretty neat I never never loaded it I brought one for 410 uh, I used to when I was a kid I had a Sears and Roebuck was it Sears? Yeah, Sears. Uh, 410 pump. <laughs> I can remember dove hunting with my dad. and Boy, I'd knock the feathers plum off them doves. They just keep flying. <laughs> I don't know if that was my marksmanship or the uh, failure of the, sh <laughs> the hulls or the shells. But Oh, well. Well, guys, that's all I had to share. I thought Fuzzy might get a kick out of that. <laughs> Thanks, guys, for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.